people were served. He promised investors big returns in a house flipping business, but instead he ran a Ponzi scheme that took millions for more than 170 people. How did he do it? Contact Six's Katrina Cravey has the story. Deals in real estate can be a sound investment. So when investors heard that they could make 12% return on their money by investing in a business that was buying and then quickly selling houses, hundreds signed up. The problem? Donald Lacey, the former police officer who pitched them, wasn't trying to make them money. What Mr. Lacey did not tell his investors was that the money was going to three entities that were under his control and he took the money for his personal use. Postal inspectors say Lacey's investment scam cost more than 200 people over $9 million. That money was spent once again on homes, vehicles, boats, things along those lines. Authorities say Lacey used his position as a former police officer to cheat people around him. Because Mr. Lacey was highly regarded in the community, the people that he solicited from were people that knew him very well. Postal inspectors say it's very important for you to research the company before you give it any money. And of course, if you've been involved in any type of crime involving the U.S. mail, there is a website for you to post a complaint online. We put a link on our webpage, fox6now.com. I'm Katrina Cravey. Contact 6. Wow.